Fala galera do DCS Words, esse vídeo é uma preciosidade, saiu o primeiro vídeo do DCS Word FA18C Hornet, esse é o primeiro vídeo que vocês vão ver internamente do nosso futuro FA18C Hornet para o DCS Word pessoal, eu vou deixar o um link original do vídeo para quem quiser acompanhar o assinante do canal, Acompanha aí, primeiro vídeo, FA18C Hornet, ele está chegando pessoal. Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics. Well, I'm back from E3, and one of the things I promised when I was at E3 was that when I got home, I'd go ahead and record a video of a typical E3 demo that we did. Now, being E3, and as you might imagine, these demos were very simple, such that a casual user could fly DCS and have a good time. So I tried to record this as much as, as possible to replicate that, uh, even labels and bad rocket runs and all. So for the uh, next few minutes, I put together a mission that pretty much mirrors the uh, E3 demo mission we did. So the mission consists of a Hornet uh, over Las Vegas with some ground targets and some air targets. And folks generally had a lot of fun uh, using unguided rockets and the sidewinder and the gun. And uh, naturally everyone uh, at least once had to go uh, puzz the uh, Las Vegas strip. Now for E3, we're mostly there in a very low-key, under-the-radar mode, uh, mainly because the Hornet's still in uh, pre-alpha and has a long way to go, and just uh, not an opportune time for us to really push hard at a show like E3. But it was a, a great opportunity for us to meet with some advertisers, some select press, and naturally with our great friends at Thrustmaster about the cooperation with the Hornet stick, and hopefully some future projects as well. But it was also a great opportunity for us to interact with some casual users to see what they liked and what they didn't like with DCS. So now that uh, E3 is done and we have the Normandy map out, you know, we can finally really start talking about the Hornet, uh, finally. And what we're going to be doing over the next several months is that as new uh, systems come online in the Hornet and we feel they're pretty final, uh, we'll talk about them, we'll start doing videos about them, and, and kind of bring you guys up to speed as System of My System uh, comes online and starts really building out the Hornet. So as early as next week, I think, I'll probably start the first videos, which will discuss some of the systems already up and running in the Hornet, uh, some of which you can actually see uh, in the demo running right now. In fact, I don't think it will be too long before you guys are starting to feel you're hearing too much about the Hornet and feel you're being teased too much. Now, over the next several months, we'll be adding more and more features and functionality to the Hornet. And when we get to the point where we feel there's a lot of great functionality and features and really uh, compelling gameplay, uh, at that point we'll go ahead and we will release the early access version to the public. And, you know, per our usual practice, once we do offer the pre-purchase, at that point we'll announce the release date then. So that's a little look at the Hornet as many of the attendees at E3 saw it, and we hope you enjoyed that. Obviously it's a very early uh, pre-alpha look but also wanted to talk a little bit about where we are with the Hornet right now and you know, where we see it going over the next uh, few months and how we're going to uh, share that information with you. So again, uh, thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Thanks.